used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up or laughed them off. Sometimes both. But we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years, even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be when it does. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him, however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. Whoops. Let's go. Well, hello. Apparently I'm too lazy to carry something, and I'm going to go see if I can actually help them. This is Assassin's Creed 3 if you haven't worked that out, and if you haven't worked that out, then what the fuck is wrong with you? Check out my backpack. Kind of nice. Um, I'm on Ultra Graphics, so that looks cool. And apparently I can't sprint. So yeah, I played the first Assassin's Creed and loved it um, much so much that everyone else hated it for whatever reason. Oh, what? Excuse me, I'm more important. I don't have to stand in the line.
In another moment, down went Alice after it, never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. Well, that does kind of shitty. Didn't even lift properly. That's weird. She got teleported forward. But yeah, I played the first one and a lot of people hated the first one. But I saw extreme potential in the game. So gave it a shot, gave it a chance. And uh, played it for irrelevant of all the constant cutscenes. And the second game was just everything that it needed to be. It was insanely good. I saw the Brotherhood and all the expansions after that. Uh, you know, Assassin's Creed 1 and Assassin's Creed 2. Part of the main story canon and the rest was just filler. And I did not play those based on that fact. It was just stupid that they even existed. But anyway, here we are. Assassin's Creed 3. Desmond finally going to unlock some secret. I think we're here. No shit. Whoa. Lost my light. No, I didn't. Give me, give me back. Back. Ah, Desmond, you're so stupid. They're all too uh, wimpy to come down with me. So that's good. I assume this is to build atmosphere, the reason I can't sort of run. Oh, okay, it's just right click and it never told me. triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. So naturally, you dropped me into the Animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay? <laughs> you weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you, and I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Right. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. There's no idea where it is, though. Guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. She? Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. Juno from Juno. She's still pregnant. Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. All right. What do you need me to do? We'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. Okay. Space is a fast walk. And right is run. If you didn't know, holding right, holding the sprint key is basically okay, just Desmond. win. 
Let's practice climbing on these objects. Just practice climbing. What you want to do is you want to hold up and hold right, and then you're there. Done. I still like it. It looks cool. I'm sure it's as easy as this in real life. I'm certain of it. So it was really enjoyable to climb over these things. What I know about this game is that um free run your way through this little obstacle course. What I know about this the game is that it was really enjoyable to see the scenery, the old towns and just be transported into a life that was once had by many and now doesn't really exist anymore, it's completely changed. It was nice to see old cities in front of you. It was really cool. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. <laughs> Alright, Desmond, follow the on screen instructions and kill the two Templars. Okay, crouch. But my problem with this game is that I won't be able to run over things as far as I'm aware, it's just through woods and fields. I mean, sure, I'll have some, but it'll be limited, limited surely. So, they've added a new longer jump. So I just press space. Oops. So I hold right, press space, and fucking jump. And fail! Okay. Wow, what? Lived up. I'll just go over here. How about that? That. <laughs> seems, <laughs> seems wider. Now I want to do the long jump. Ba -ba. Okay. I keep doing that. Damn, I stop doing that now. Nah. Sorry about that. environments. I mean in the first game they had, you do basically the exact same thing except it was in the real world which I kind of prefer. I'm sure this won't last too long. Just giving you examples of uh, how it would be in the game. We're gonna get more realistic now. Levels look good now. We should be able to build the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. God look at them fucking uh, clothing is just Wonderful. So, so cool. Look at the world just being curated in front of you. If you don't think that's cool, there's something wrong with you. Uh, uh, everything alright, sir? Yes, fine. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. By the world. Kind of creating itself in front of me. Thank you. Where shall I retreat? You're done. Front of the opera house. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her round at once. Here we are. Invitation, please. Invitation, please. Shall I take your coat, sir? Fuck off, I like my coat. Here it is. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. What if I want to rudely find my seat? Be mean about it. Push some guy out of the way. Good evening, sir. This way, please. This is amazing. It looks so good. Time to shimmy. My apologies. Yeah, why was that guy fucking staring at me? Evening, Haytham. Evening. Reginald. Reginald. I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? 
Once, my father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, I'm afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? Eagle vision. Oh, good. Got this is back. Gold target. Ah, dip. Way up there. A lawyer is an honest employment. So is mine. Like me too, he accidentally. He's seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. You'll need to find another way up. Ooh, a ladder. I already have. Good. That sick word of trial comes on in the afternoon. And she hopes you will order matters oh. so as to bring her off. They are needing a as card the for very this. active and industrious. You may satisfy oh. that our soft this the evidence. Here too long. Oh. Gag, a thousand pardons. I'm so sorry. Oh, my apologies. <laughs> Sit back down. I told him what it would come to if he did not mend his hand. This is All right, I can't just vault over that. Everyone will fucking stare at me. Okay, things are about to get interesting. How is no one noticing me? This is insane. Let me just, just grab the woman and I'll be off. I'm sure no one would mind. Interesting what's going on there. Oh, we've got some fancy men here. Hiya! The atmosphere, just all the NPCs, is really cool. It's quite believable. Higher. I'm sure the actual um, play down there is probably one that's actually... They've not just made it up. They're just reconstructing a real one. Look at the orchestra down there. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, I should stop taking the sights. <laughs> Move the mouse left and right to locate the place of tension. This is much more in depth than that of Skyrim. So I find the tension. Found the tension. Right there. And then I break the lock. That is way better than just finding a tiny gap. Oh, this is where all the actors are. That's not them. There, down there. That's cool. Don't mind me, I'm just, uh, oh shit. I'm just doing shit. Alright, come on, get get hold of yourself, character. Oh, Dutch Courage, can I have some of that? I can't go Eagle Vision right now. The Beggar's Opera. Oh, careful, Moon. Moon. Oh, it's a marvel. Oh, that Jeremy. Here we are. That was easy. Just seat yourself next to him. You should have come to me. We would have found another way. Yes. But then you would have known. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. As am I. Bye bye! Casually a boy staring at all this. 
Well, I'm gonna have to murder you as well now. I wonder who that boy is gonna grow up to be. I'm sure I'll find out. It'll be very painful. Just checking me out. It's it's the it's the coat, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I get it a lot. Sweet coat. I'm gonna buy one of them myself. RL. And uh, now madness is gonna happen. Absolute madness. Oh, Jesus! Oh, that is convenient. Nope. Hold space while walking to walk fast and push. I'm already. I'm way ahead of your game. Way ahead of you. God, I, get out of my way. Uh, it's a killer on the loose. I want to get out of here. There's no danger. I'm just right here. Look at all of them. That is so cool. Orchestra's moved as well. They're not just moving. They're taking everything into account. Excuse me. Imbecile. God. Garfield. Nope. Conveniently not me, once again. It's the cape. It's taking the atmosphere a little. Words aren't needed for this. Reminds me of uh, Hitman. You know, because there's a Hitman and that. Or Assassin, if you like. And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. Apart from the murder. Shall we be off then? Aye. To Fleet and Bride. By your command. Dude, how long have you been looking at that shit? How long? Look at how old he is I now! In my hand a key. If this book is to be believed, it will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Ah, yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? It could contain certain knowledge. Perhaps a weapon, or something as yet unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. They are still an enigma, these precursors. But of one thing I am certain. Whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or our enemies, should they find it first. They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this storehouse is? Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. Avoiding the question. How fair your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. I'm yours to command. Although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. With them at your side, we'll want for nothing. Well, then I'd best be on my way. I knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We've booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. Go forth, Haytham, and bring honor to us all. That was a deadly performance. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed and look forward to more. This game is fucking insanely good already. I can't wait to play more of it, and, uh, yeah. That's good for...